You, you never know what you'll find in the universe of my mind. Okay, it's time for another episode of Creatively Wrecking This Journal. I have this old book here that I had made a pumpkin out of and then decided to discard that, but I kept this to use for arting stuff. Anyway, and it's it's a good height to act like a table, sort of, to level it out a bit and it's working out pretty good. Helps a little bit with the wonkiness and troublesomeness of of these things. The of working in this journal because <laughs> because of all the lumpy and bumpy and etc. Anyway, so the page I'm doing today is page number 15. 14 and 15 because I'm going to do a double page spread thing. This color this entire page. So I have a plan. So I have this coloring page that came from a newspaper or several years ago. Uh, I have several copies of it, uh, but I I just need the one for this. I'm going to fussy cut some of the pieces and, and stuff, but I'm going to start by coloring this entire page like it says. <laughs> so let's see. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out the better angles to put your to to put you <laughs> um because it wasn't really working out right for you to to be where you were before because the because my hand was pretty well blocking everything I was doing and I don't think this is much better but I don't really have a better setup yet I'm hoping to figure something out soon anyway enough of that let's see this is periwinkle do i want periwinkle mm, i'd rather have sky blue if i can find it there it is sky blue okay so these are my good old crayola crayons where's the hmm. I can't find the, the, the seam. There it is. Okay. So I'm going to start with that. And just... Hmm. Barely noticeable. But I'm still going to do it. Maybe I better put a... Something under there. It's kind of like a texture plate. Yes, it's green, but it's kind of supposed to be green, I guess, because it's grass. base coat right now for this for this and then I'm going to do some texture make it look a bit more grassy I probably should have been going in the other direction with this but oh well Oh, 
Okay, and now, like I was saying, I'm gonna I'm just going flump 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 like that. And it's gonna take a while. So I'll be back. Okay, now that that part's done, I'm I'm going to retrieve that page that I just made fall to the floor. Okay, now that that's done, I'm going to color the bits that I want to fussy cut. Then I'll fussy cut them, and then I'll be back. Cause, well, maybe I'll do just a little bit and then and I'm going to use my crayons if they will work for me it takes so long to find the the color I'm looking for and they don't work the greatest probably because they're very old I say that a lot lately my things are very old Oh well, I'll just, I'll use peach. Take only pink for some cheeks. And maybe Wisteria for shading, which isn't working very well, but it'll do. Okay, and then, so yeah, I'm just going to finish coloring the bits I want, and, which is probably pretty close to the whole thing. And then I'll fussy cut, and then I'll be back. Okay, now I just need to... Figure out where I want to glue them. Is that all of them? Probably. Well, that looks good. Probably I'll do that. Do I even want that part? Oh, where's the, where's the dog house? I think I'm gonna... I don't think I'm gonna add that. Unless I... No. I think I'm gonna leave that out. Found it. I mean, that's pretty close to what was the original on. page. I'm, I'm going to make a little path there, but uh, I'm going to glue things down first. 
hopefully it'll still work over the wax crayon. Yeah, seems to be working okay. So technically I could have stopped right there where I left it before I started coloring and fussy cutting because I did color the entire page. But okay. I uh, didn't think of this until now, so eh, it's good enough. Not perfect, but good enough. Okay. So yeah, it's it's pretty much the placement is pretty much what was on the original coloring page, but so what. Maybe maybe he maybe that one's there. Is that too much on this side? I kinda like it. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. I'm not using my whatever this is called because because of all the lumpies and whatever it's just easier to do it with my hands and fingers. Hmm, it's just it's working better than I expected it to, so that's good. Okay, I think I will color that. No. Well, maybe. I'm going to use this metallic, whatever it is. It's kind of a gray, oh, deep space sparkle to make. A couple of a few uh, birds in the sky. This is it's thick, so it's hard to to make them thin. One more. No, one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Then I'm gonna like do a little bit of writing in here, the date mostly, and stuff like that, and then I'll call it done. <laughs> 